All right, well, tonight the World Health Organization is investigating more than 90 cases of monkeypox in a dozen countries, including here in the United States. A lead advisor says the unprecedented outbreak may be connected to sexual encounters at two raves in Spain and Belgium. So here's what experts say we need to know about this rare but potentially serious viral illness. So what is monkeypox? It's a disease from the same family as smallpox. It's found in animals in Africa, including monkeys and rodents. Initial symptoms include fever, aches, fatigue, and swollen lymph nodes. Typically, one to three days later, a rash develops, often starting on the face and then spreading. So how is monkeypox spread? Not generally human to human, says Dr. Aubrey Gordon from the University of Michigan School of Public Health. But when it is transmitted that way, it's usually through close contact. Um, so that's typically through large droplets, so think saliva, um, or through direct contact, so from, from pus, from the lesions on skin. In this particular outbreak, it does appear to be being transmitted through sexual contact. Um, there's a lot of work going on right now to figure out how it's being uh, transmitted and risk factors for being exposed. So how concerned should we be? We definitely need to keep an eye on it and monitor it, um, but monkeypox at this time isn't as transmissible as something like SARS-CoV-2. With monkeypox, it's very unlikely that there will be a lot of transmission before it's detected, just because it causes these really characteristic, characteristic skin lesions, right? So it's pretty easy to identify or much easier to identify cases. Well, the smallpox vaccine can be used to protect against monkeypox as well. It can even be given soon after an exposure. It's thought people who received the vaccine previously may still have some level of protection.